Petitioners are calling upon the House of Commons to adopt Bill S-210, protecting young persons from exposure to the Pornography Act. Thank you, Madam Speaker. Presenting petitions, the RL member for Kitchener Centre. Thank you, Madam Speaker. It's an honour to present a petition that recognises that 22% of Canadians have a disability and that housing policy discriminates against people with disabilities. Specifically, they cite that no building code in Canada mandates that housing be accessible. They note that this leads to thousands being forced out of their dwellings at the, at the most vulnerable times in their lives, millions of health care dollars that could be saved by enabling people to remain in their own accessible homes. They go on to call for this House of Commons to, first of all, amend the National Building Code to make universal, de universal design mandatory in all new multi-unit housing developments under the jurisdiction of the Government of Canada, consistent with current legislation and, and conventions, and to ensure the Canadian Table for Harmonized Construction Codes Policy, Canadian Board for Harmonized Construction Codes, and the CMHC collaborate on defining and illustrating in the National Building Code what is visitable, adaptable, accessible, barrier-free, and universal design. And finally, to require public funds or concessions for housing conferred on municipalities, developers, or other organizations to be exclusively used for universally designed housing. Thank you. Presenting petitions, the Honourable for Waterloo. Thank you, Madam Speaker. I have a couple of petitions um, that have been shared to 